right um so here's how it works in my car and here's the way i do it um, first of all let's go to our settings and let's go to light and visibility and let's go to reverse option all right with that checked on every time you put it in reverse the passenger mirror will tilt down to with that checked on you can always take it out of that by pushing the driver's side window button that right there and that will lift the mirror so that will automatically tilt it down every time you put it in reverse you can manually take it out of that setting by pushing that button I drive around with that with that off so let's just toggle that off now I drive around with that off and so um, every time that I put it into reverse I have that just automatically set on the passenger side and it pretty much does the same thing as that with the check mark in the box so here we go so that's on and that's on the driver's side or can be considered off I'm gonna put it in reverse and it goes down right now I can take it out of that by pushing the driver's side here See, check mark is still on. All right. Now with the check mark off, I put it in reverse, or it's in reverse actually, because it's still there. Nothing happens, right? However, if that's on, it turns down, right? And so now, um, let's just here. We'll take it out really quick. Okay. Now that's that's on. All right. Now it's pretty much the same thing as having that box checked. I put it in reverse and it turns down there you go pretty much how it works so that being said all you need to do is push that button you don't need to even mess with anything in there if you want that to tilt down or not tilt down hopefully it helps have a good day everybody